Yo, it's good. It's Wi Fi's funeral. I'm on a whole lot of gang shit with a fader. And you watching this bitch, you already know what it is. I don't really think people have bad face tats, to be honest with you. I feel like face tats are like a, a form of expression. Like, Gucci got a fucking ice cream cone tattooed on his face. Like, you can't even consider that as the worst one, you know what I mean? That shit's legendary. Like, I've seen. I've seen a lot of weird shit. My homeboy Vice has a has a revolver right here on his on his on his cheek, and I'm like, damn, like why didn't I think of that? Like, I don't I don't really look at face tattoos as like oh that's like really bad. It's like I like shitty tattoos, to be real with you. Like I like scribble like jailhouse like looking tattoos. Those shits are hard. I think I think I'm obsessed with imperfection. I don't like things perfect. I don't like things like symmetrical or like none of that shit. Just slap it there. If it looks good, it looks good. I'm more about placement. Daylight. Daylight oh my ever, god. Bro. Daylight got the best face <laughs> tat ever, bro. Daylight got he's got like uh the eye part of Spawn's mask, like all right here. I feel like a lot of people get this idea of me and run off based of that idea of me as opposed to like, yo, I'm gonna actually listen to this music and see if I actually like it. It's a double-edged sword. It can motivate you or it can break you. That's like that's like asking Kobe, like, yo, y'all niggas made it to like the Western Conference Finals the whole time, but you know what I mean? Y'all never won the playoffs. Like, that don't get to you at all? Like, yeah, that's gonna get some, you know what I mean? Like, you, you there, but you're not there. You know what I mean? Like, and that's one thing about me, like, I'm just on some Ricky Bobby shit. Like, if you ain't first, you last. Like, I want it all. I want all of it. I don't fuck how I get it, where I get it, when I get it. I want it all. I wouldn't be nowhere that, that I'm at without the internet, point blank period. Bro, the internet, like, saved my life, to be honest with you. Like, I dropped out of school when I was, like, in the 10th grade. So, like, I would really, like, educate myself through the internet only or, like, through any type of books that I would pick up. The internet nowadays is, like, the new age, like, artist development. Like, you cannot even know what you're getting yourself into and still kind of, like, get the grasp of it quick just because it's all right there on the internet. Like, all the resources right there on the internet. Like, everybody that you need to talk to is right there on the internet. I think about it this way. Like, I wonder who Slick Rick wanted to fucking collaborate with at his prime. You know what I mean? That was, like, across the country. Like, imagine if him and, like, Shabo Ranks did, like, a song together. Like, that would have been possible this in, in this day and time. It would have been a quick Instagram DM, a quick phone call, a quick this, a quick that. Like, they had to, like... Go through the middleman to the middleman to talk to the head and then get it approved by the head and then that other middleman like i did a song with jid and i'm like yo like i need to do a song with jid four hours later we're in the fucking studio you know what i mean it's just wild as individuals and as a uh, young men understand that like our voice is like a really powerful tool if i say something to you and it's bullshit only thing you're ever going to expect out of me is bullshit you won't take me serious in any form or way that's just 100% fact. I feel like we all take into consideration the fact that our voices are powerful and when we say something, we're not just gonna say bullshit. I don't feel like that's why we have the impact that we have. If I feel like I'm not gonna say something that's gonna like inspire you or something that's gonna like stick with you or something that's gonna like help me evolve in my life, I'll, I'll stay quiet all day. I don't mind not talking.